What's up guys, Peter Gilmore here on the Peter Gilmore channel, Peter fucking Gilmore channel. Now, I would do some, re I do wrestling news here, but I talk about some real life stuff. Otherwise, I would do it on my, uh, my, my TGC Reborn channel as well, but, you know, but I want to do it here because we got some breaking fucking news. I just went out to get a, uh, some, a bagel at my local bagel store. I just came back and I got a notification uh, from Twitter, oh my god, I am so happy right now, I'm going fucking nuts, you know how big of a Met fan I am right now, and I've been a Met fan for a long time, so, but breaking news, ladies and gentlemen, from New York Metland, the New York Mets have just signed Cy Young Pitcher, and I talked about this last night on my Sunday night stream on TGC Real Bowling, you can go down, go uh, watch that on the channel, down below, on TGC Reborn, link to the channel down below, uh, so I just, <laughs> it is what it is, so, the Mets have just signed Cy Young, pitcher, who used to pitch for the Dodgers last year, he has pitched for the Nationals, Cy Young winner, Max Scherzer is coming to the Mets, holy shit, <laughs> baby, oh yes, oh yes, ah yes, Oh, yes. Oh, I am so happy. Three years, $130 million. Max Scherzer gonna be a New York Met for three years, motherfuckers. Oh, man. I can't, be I, I can't wait for the race to the Cy Young next year. Who's gonna be DeGrom? Is it gonna be Scherzer? Or gonna be, well, maybe someone else, but nobody cares. But holy shit, ladies and gentlemen, if you're a Met fan, your Christmas came early. Oh, it's great. I know the, the, the baseball might be shutting down on Thursday. I don't care. We got shows, you motherfuckers! Yes! Yes, motherfuckers! Scherzer is here. Three years, 130 fucking million hours. Uncle Stevie Cohen, I could kiss you if I was, you know, well, I'm not gay, but if I was, I would kiss you and, you know, do a whole bunch of things, but I'm not gay, but it is what it is. But, ah, oh, yes. Thank you, Uncle Stevie. Thank you. We got a couple pieces in, you know, on the bench. We got Sterling Marte over over the Thanksgiving holiday to play center field. We're going to kick Nimmo to right field or left field. Marte can also be a DH. Same with Cano. I know Cano is coming back and we don't really want to care about that. And, um, you know... Not not really a great third baseman. I, I think Jonathan Villar is going to play third base this year for the Mets. Eh, he does have some pop, but I'll just say that. Um, and then, really, we need bullpen help right now. So, maybe Uncle Stevie in the next couple days. I think, think between today, tomorrow, and Wednesday. Hopefully, you can get another big deal done. Sign Marcus Stroman. Resign Marcus Stroman, I say. Resign Baez, if he doesn't go to Detroit. But... We lost out on Kevin Gossman. That's okay. We got Scherzer. We don't give a shit. It is what it is. But now the Mets rotation. <sighs> One and two. Forget. That's an, that gives you a guaranteed win. Almost. All the time. Sometimes, you know, Scherzer and DeGrom. You know, sometimes they have a shaky start. But nine times out of ten. Guaranteed. Guaranteed win. Unless the bullpen fucks it up. But it is what it is. But what the Mets rotation right now, Scherzer, I think, will be number two, the number two guy. Sorry. Yeah, got to get kicked for DeGrom. So, me, DeGrom, Scherzer, Taiwan Walker at number three, possibly Stroman at number four if they do re-sign him. And then number five could be Peterson, Lucchese, or a Carrasco, or they get put in the bullpen. Well, one of those guys is going to be put in the bullpen. Sad for you. And then, uh, well, the closer situation, we still got Edwin Diaz and Lugo. I don't know about Familia. Trevor May is always up and down. Check on high, that guy is. But same thing with La, Fami La Familia, which in Spanish means I fuck up sometimes. Now we got Edwin Diaz, who's shaky. I mean, the last couple years, he's been shaky. Lugo's been the same way. So, got a shaky bullpen. No, the, the closing part of the bullpen, like the, the seven, eight, not... 7th, 8th, ninth inning guys, usually shaky, but now they get the job done once in a while. But the middle relief, the 6th, 7th, and maybe the 8th inning guys, 
you know, we lost Aaron Loop, which was our best bullpen guy, to go to the Angels. We lost Thor, you know, Syndergaard to the Angels. That's what it is. But we got Scherzer. We don't give a shit. We don't. We don't. So, Met fans, enjoy your early Christmas present. And maybe more to come in the next couple of days. Yes. Max Scherzer, welcome to New York. I know you may not like it, but you're going to learn to love it, like Ric Flair says. So, so hopefully there'll be a season this year. I know it's the baseball shut down on Thursday because these idiots don't not they can't can't uh, agree on anything. Hopefully it won't baseball won't be shut down too long. Maybe the rest of this uh, December going up, going into the holiday season, going into the new year January. Hopefully to get it, get something done by the time pitchers and catchers would be coming back in mid February, and hopefully we have a spring training and we have a 2022 baseball season because I definitely want to get tickets to see Scherzer, DeGrom, and the New York Mets in 2022 because this right now, Uncle Stevie is not playing games right now. And you can shut up, Yankee fan. <laughs> ah, you too. <laughs> Zeus is a Yankee fan, by the way. Well, she's a fan, but... I don't know. I don't know. But, yeah. So, I mean... So, so all you Yankee fans out there, uh, yeah, you had a really bad offseason. What did you get? Nothing yet. But, you know, there's still... It's still... Well, though today, tomorrow, and Wednesday, you may be getting Carlos Correa. He does want to come to New York. Can you get him? Mm, we'll see. If Cashman can get his head out of his ass... Maybe you guys can get an early Christmas present and call us Korea who can play short stuff for you guys. If not, well, fuck you, Yankee fans. Fuck you. And that's all I got to say about that. So so I'm going to end this right away. I'm going to have my, my bagel. I'm going to enjoy myself. Maybe watch some Met highlights. Maybe watch some Max Scherzer highlights. I'm going to have a great day. I'm having a great day. Oh, it's such a great weekend, man. Thanksgiving weekend with the family. Made me so happy. And then getting Sterling Marte over the you know, all this past weekend. Now we got Max Scherzer today. Oh, baby. Oh, it's great to be a New Yorker. It is so great. Well, fuck the Knicks. They suck. The Rangers. Rangers are doing great. And even the Giants and the Jets won yesterday. But who cares about that? The Niners won yesterday. That's the most important thing. But, but it is what it is. So. I had a great weekend. I had a, I'm having a great day today. Scherzer's here. Ah, oh, yes. Oh, yeah. I love it. I love being a New Yorker. I love it. Even though the weather sucks, you know, coming up. You know, got the winter coming up, so it's going to suck really bad. But, you know, that's not going to bring us New Yorkers down. Fucking COVID's not going to bring us down. And not even you fuck trolls are going to bring me down or anybody else down. So, fuck you. And that's all I got to say about it. So, but anyway, if you, you know, you're just going to, just watching this video, you just came out from your hole. Max Scherzer is a New York fucking Met. Three years, 130 million. It's going to be a great season. If there is a season. Hopefully there will be. But if there is, JD and your Braves... Enjoy your tainted little World Series win. Because I guarantee you this, JD, your Braves are going to die. When you face the Mets early in April, because you do face us in April, you motherfuckers. You face DeGrom and Scherzer back to back. Nice knowing you. So, JD, hold on to that World Series title real tight. Real tight, ladies and Real tight, JD. Hold on to that tainty title real tight. Because the New York Mets, baby, we're back. And we're coming for vengeance. Thank you, Uncle Stevie. Thank you, Uncle Stevie. Now, can you get a manager? Can you get a base guy? Can you get a general manager, please? Can you get a manager? Can you get a president of baseball operations? Can you re-sign Baez? Can you re-sign Strowman? Or make another big deal in the next three days? I mean, two big deals so far, Uncle Stevie. We love you. You want to win now. 
Give us a goddamn fucking title. Because I think 2022 is win or bust. I mean, th last year was, but... Well, this year was, but... We choked near the end, but it is what it is. But next year, the Grom, Scherzer, Marte, <sighs> Alonzo, the Universal DH, which no way really cares about. But oh, I can't wait, ladies and gentlemen. I am... Oh, it's great to be a Met fan. Just sucks to be you, Yankee fans. It just really, really, really sucks. But if you get Correa, well, there's your Christmas present. But yeah, Brian Cashman needs to go. I'm just saying. For, for you Yankee fans out there, Brian Cashman is getting fired after the season. And probably Aaron Boone, you know, Baboon is going to get, get, get destroyed. He's going to get, he's going to, he's gone, he's gone after the season. Cashman and Boone, bye bye. After the, after 2022, I guarantee that. Sorry to Vic, my good buddy Vic Gibitetto. So, it is what it is. But, that's all I got to say about that. I'm going to enjoy my bagel now. I'm enjoying being a Met fan. And I'm going to enjoy my day. And you should too. Well, for you fuck trolls, you can continue to do what you do best. And that's ride my dick. And keep thinking about me 24-7, 365. Because you will acknowledge me whether you like it or not, motherfuckers. Because your little exposure videos did not work. Did not work. You failed again. And you will continue to fail for years to come. So, you can blow me, and you can suck my dick. And you can suck basically everybody else's dick in the prophecy. So, that's all I gotta say about that. So, thank you for watching. I'll be back later tonight, or maybe later today, if there's any breaking wrestling news, or any other breaking news. But, it is what it is. So, if there's any breaking wrestling news, I'll talk about it. But if not, got Monday Night Raw tonight. Edge is coming back tonight. Ratings boost. So, we'll see what happens on Raw tonight. From the Nassau Mausoleum in Belmont Park, Strong Island, New York. Probably be a sucky as fuck show. But we'll see what happens with that. And I'll be live later on tonight for a little bit. Not too long because I don't have much time on StreamYard. Um, I might be able to... I'm, I'm going to see if I can actually do it off the phone because I think I have capability going live off the phone now, but I have to see about that, but I think I have enough time to do the review, I think I have about like an hour and a half to do the review that I have left on StreamYard, so maybe I can be, be able to do the hour and a half stream, um, but I'll see what I can do, I don't want to make it too long, you know, because it's late Monday night, like 11.30, 12 o'clock at night, and um, I'm going to just talk about Raw for a little bit, and then uh, that's it, get ready for Tuesday, that's it. All right. Thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, such a great day to be a Met fan, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to New Welcome to New York, Sterling Marte and Max Scherzer. Don't let us down, please, for the love of God. Like you know, like other people that came to New York did. Not saying Lindor, but you know, or Baez, because Baez had a great great time in New York when he came here. So, but hopefully we can sign Baez. We can re-sign Marcus Stroman. We have some money left, I think, but. You know, but hopefully we can get those two big pieces there. And then maybe try to work on the bullpen a little bit. Hopefully get a manager before the, the shutdown. I doubt that. A general manager and a president of baseball operations. <coughs> Excuse me. Allergies. But it is what it is. And that's all I got to say about that. So, Max Scherzer, a New York Met. And to everybody else in the... National League and the American League, especially you Yankee fans out there, be jealous. I'll see you guys later. I'm Peter Gilmore, signing out. And all I got to say to that is, let's go Mets!